everybody, I'm Sherry. Welcome back to my channel. Are you looking for an easy to put together chocolate dessert? Why not a chocolate Swiss roll cake? So easy, so yummy, and not too sweet. So let's get started. So go ahead and get your oven preheated to 425 and we're gonna go ahead and start the sponge part. To the egg yolks, you're going to mix the sugar and cream it together until it's a pale yellow. All right, so now we're going, we're going to mix our egg and sugar mixture into our cocoa powder and cake flour, along with our instant coffee, baking powder, and salt. All right, and this is gonna seem off, but it's not, just follow along. It's gonna seem very thick, and that's okay, because we're going to fluff it up with the egg whites. So don't panic. <clears throat> so that's what you're looking for. All right, we're gonna whisk our egg whites up into frothy peaks. All right, so this is about the stage that we're looking for. So now what you wanna do is you wanna take about a quarter of this mixture and go ahead and work this in. And then you just wanna slowly get some more in and fold it in. And the rest of it. So in a greased jelly roll pan, or cookie sheet, or whatever you have, you're going to spread out your batter. And you're gonna bake it for about eight minutes, and I'll show you what we do next. Our cake just came out of the oven. It's done. You can see it presses back. We're going to sprinkle some, oops, some powdered sugar, and this is to keep it from sticking on the tea towel when we roll it. Place the cooling rack. Flip your cake onto it. Carefully peel your paper off your cake. And now we're gonna go, we're on the short side, we're gonna roll it in with our towel. And this is so that the cake gets the memory of being in a roll. Now it needs to cool. So you're going to leave it. So for the filling, we're gonna whip up some heavy cream with a little bit of sugar and vanilla. If you want some, it's optional. So this is the soft stage. You wanna go ahead and add your sugar here. or sugar. And 
you want to gently unravel it. Spoon in our filling, and you want to have an even layer. And on the fun part, we get to roll it back up. All right, so the ganache is um, heated cream, about a quarter of a cup with some bittersweet chocolate. You can use semi-sweet if that's what you prefer. Um, I'm trying to tone down all the sugar that's going on in here with a little bit of milk to make it a pourable consistency. So what you're going to do 